So for breakfast I'm making banana pancakes, so I'm just going to mash up two bananas. You can obviously use a fork if you want, but I find it easier to use one of these potato mashers. So these pancakes are so filling, really healthy and also super tasty. I like doing them in the mornings where I have a lot of time and they just keep you full for a long time. I really love that about them. And you can make banana pancakes vegan. I can like link a recipe down below, but I'm not gonna do that today. And then I'm just gonna add four eggs. And this is for two people, but you can always make for two people and then eat what you can eat and then save the rest. So now I'm just gonna whisk all of this together. And then for some more protein, I'm going to be adding some oats. So I'm just going to be adding about two deciliters and this is just going to make them a lot more filling and healthy. I'm also going to be adding some vanilla sugar which is a Swedish thing but you could just add some vanilla essence or something I think you have in the US. And I'm just taking one teaspoon of this vanilla sugar. You can honestly add whatever you want. You can add um, cinnamon if you want just so you can like alter the taste of your pancakes to how you like them. So now I'm just gonna mix all of this together and then your pancake mixture is done and ready to fry on the frying pan. So what I'm gonna do is use a bit of butter to fry my pancakes just because I feel like it tastes a lot better than oil but obviously you can use oil if you want. So I'm just gonna put my butter in here and I'm gonna put my stove on about number six, so medium heat. I will lower it when the butter has got a bit hotter. So now I'm just gonna take a little bit, about that much, and put it on my frying pan. I always have some berries, some syrup because I think it just tastes so good and sometimes I also have some whipped cream on it just to make it extra tasty. <laughs> These are going to be my toppings today and I normally have them all on at once which you'll see. <laughs> so this is how many it made, it made quite a few so that's good and I will normally just eat as many as I feel like because they're so good I'll normally just eat until I can't eat anymore so like I don't know, five. And then I just drizzle some syrup on top. Yummy. And that is the pancakes. They look probably not as good as they taste. They taste amazing. So for lunch I just decided to make a lovely mozzarella salad or mozzarella like pasta salad kind of so I cut a mozzarella up, I love mozzarella so much, it's honestly the best thing ever and also tomato, I love tomato so I just cut a tomato up as well and an avocado because we all know avocados are amazing and also really good for you and this is just my favourite way of slicing an avocado. And then I just cooked some pasta and then I just poured olive oil all over it and some oregano. And I normally put some salt on it as well. Yeah, here I'm putting salt on. I used Himalaya salt and then for dinner I just went out for a pizza, <laughs> keeping it real here. 
I always like to have a little snack after my dinner later at night, maybe at like eight or nine-ish. I just like to have a snack and chill and watch some YouTube, so. This is the snack I made today. It tastes amazing. This was actually my first time trying it. So I just mashed a banana up and put like a teaspoon or more maybe of cocoa powder in it and just mixed it all up. And then I just added some honey to make it a little bit more sweet. And then I just topped it with some muesli and this tasted really, really nice. I definitely recommend it. Like you can put peanut butter or whatever you want in there. But yeah, thank you for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, comment down below and subscribe if you haven't already. I love you all. Bye. Don't forget to follow my socials uh, to keep updated with my life. I'm gonna see what I'm